When you want something, no matter how big or how small, do you ever find yourself trying to control the outcome, the speed in which it happens, the way it happens? I know I'm guilty of this at times. But then there are moments when I access this beautiful feeling called surrender. A massive step in manifesting your reality is surrendering to the outcome, trusting that God has a much bigger plan than the one you imagine. And when it's not happening naturally and organically, there is a technique that I use that instantly helps me access this state of surrender. I'll share the technique at the end of this tidbit. But first, the Ben Ishchai teaches that while we recite the verse in Tehillim or Psalms, it goes, open up your hands and provide sustenance to all life. It is custom to sit with your hands on your lap palms facing upward towards the sky in order to receive divine assistance. This is both a symbolic and metaphysical gesture of acceptance, acceptance of what is and surrender. Now, according to dialectical behavior therapy, willing hands involves performing the same actions I just described, and it's meant to help synchronize the mind and body. This allows the active mind to quiet as we enter into an experience of getting out of our own way. By engaging in a willing posture, we adopt a more accepting attitude of what is. I remember when I was eight years old, a friend of my parents came to pick up my brothers and I in order to give my parents the day off. My mom buckled me into the back seat and... As we backed out of the driveway, my mom peeked her head through the window and asked me, do you even know where you're going today? I shrugged my little shoulders, giggled, and remembered thinking, it doesn't matter. I'm excited to go on an adventure. That childlike innocence, that trust, that ability to go with the flow without needing to be in control is the inner space we should be embodying when we think of the adventure that God, Source, the Almighty, has in store for us every day. We are not in control. So the exercise I often practice when I find myself trying to control an outcome incorporates the willing hands I spoke about earlier. You sit with your hands on your lap, palm facing upwards towards the sky in a gesture of surrender and receptivity. Then visualize a big funnel at the crown of your head. With your eyes closed, begin to visualize source energy pour in through the funnel. Whatever source energy means to you. For me, I often visualize a waterfall of light but it can be a feeling like compassion or love. Bask in what it feels like to let go and let God. Enjoy this exercise and let me know how it goes for you. Sharing is caring, so if you liked what you've heard, share this with a friend. And as always, happy manifesting.